Okay, here we go, W5XJ, trying to uh, finish a project that was begun a long time ago. Here's the stepper, um, big IR vertical, and I've just had the coax and everything just laying on the ground for far too long. I've got kind of a little toroid job on that. I don't know if it's really going to help or not, but anyway, I've still got to tape all that up, but... What I've done is I've uh, used one of the Ballin Designs choke ballons there. I don't know if you can see that, but let's see here. There. Might make it a little easier to read. There it is. Anyway, I've just got the control wire and the um, thing uh, and the coax in the ground. And it kind of goes um, right through to St. Augustine. You kind of see here's some that that I haven't really finished. I still got to put it in the slit. And I'm also kind of filming this just so I can remember where the, the slit is for the future. But anyway, there's that. And I've got a little broken uh, reflector that I used to pound it in with along with the hammer. So anyhow, this is going to go along here, come all the way back to this planter, and I've kind of notched out the, the metal there, if you can see. So I'm going to have this PVC pipe will kind of stick out of that little notch, and then go back in and against the fence, and then the coax will go uh, back along there also something i put in i've had for a while and i haven't installed yet but i wanted to and i've done it now is the remote antenna switch which has really been handy and does a good job um, so you can kind of see three feed lines come in and then they terminate into this box so there's really the only need for one to come inside the shack. Get another view of the rest of that. Um, by the way, I use this tool, this Friskers tool edger that I got at Lowe's um, to make the, um, the hole, the slit if you will. It works real well. So anyhow, I'm just kind of taking this so I can remember where it is in relationship to the antenna. Looks pretty good. I work for Bob Rumsey, but I don't. I just like his stuff. It's really high quality. This is the the ballon for the 20 meter delta loop, which is up about uh, 25, 30 feet, something like that. Works real well, even close to the other one. Another thing got is this if you see the wire going up to the tree I've got a paint can that I put on here as a counterweight to keep the it's pretty simple uh, just uses a eye bolt that sticks in the wood and then comes out to the paint can kind of helps it just like the shock spring does at the other end 